السلام علیکم و رحمت اللہ و برکاتہ ویلکم ٹو حسیب الیکٹرونکس فرنس ان دس ویڈیو ویل ڈسکس ای پریکٹیکل سرکٹ فار پروٹیکٹنگ آور بیٹریز ٹویل وولٹ بیٹری دس سرکٹ is very easy to make you can install anywhere with battery and it will cut off the battery when it is fully charged so the charging cycle will be reduced every time charging discharging charging discharging this circuit will cut the battery at a specific level and then it is safe so subscribe my channel if you are new to my channel or you are first time watching my videos and press bell icon button so you can find my next videos well in time this right side I installed 12 volt battery and I connected a relay in series I start a circuit from the last end so please watch complete video this line is coming from positive uh, output of the battery charger this line directly connected to uh, negative end of battery so I connected a single pole single throw relay SPST relay okay in the series of charger this is a coil of the relay when there are voltage on the coil it will make a electromagnet which will pull the arm of the contact contacting arm contact points it will shift the points to the other end I connected a PNP transistor in series a diode okay here is a biasing resistor for this PNP transistor 2 kilo ohm in normal condition it will stay disconnected okay this PNP transistor 1418 one, uh, diode 1 and 4148 a simple rectifier diode I will connect a simple NPN transistor I will use to an series transistor you can use any 2SC series or any available NPN PNP does not matter normal signal diodes here I will connect a Zener diode 9 volt 9.2 volt you can use 6.3 volt no problem 6.3 volt to 9 volt you can use any diode I have uploaded a video I run in simulator in my computer and now I am making it perma as a practical circuit this voltage divider 2 kilo ohm and 10 kilo ohm potentiometer this I installed 10 kilo ohm potentiometer it will sense the voltage of the battery the charging voltage when it will reach at a specific level this will trigger this PNP transistor NPN transistor and it will trigger PNP transistor and it will conduct it will give voltage in the conduction status when it will go in conduct state it will turn on the relay and the point will be shifted to the other end now we will use other end we have to make uh, interlock interlock I will connect a uh, diode once it is fully charged and the points are shifted then this relay will automatically locked and it will not permit the battery to recharge again until we disconnect the charger disconnect the power 360 ohm resistor one LED when it is fully charged it will it will indicate and the relay will energized automatically by interlock diode it is simple diode 14 sorry 1 and 4148 this charging level adjustment from here we can adjust the charging level of the battery at normal charging condition the voltage level will drop 
I will make at a simple board. I will use this relay, this multi terminal relay, this four pole double throw. The center line it is connected to three points. It have a three contacts: normal open, normal close. There is a diagram on the relay. These points will be shifted. Okay, this pin is normally connected here. This is here. This pin is on the corner. When it is energized, it will switch to the other condition. Okay, friends, I will make a short video. I don't want to make a uh, very long videos. I will use double face tape, and you can see, you can copy these connections like this. I used four points of the diode for the maximum current. You can use a single uh, contactor relay because this time this relay is available with me. I will use this relay. This is positive output. Okay, this correct. We have completed this step. This relay. Now I will use two diodes. I will join both cathode of the diode together, like this. And the one diode I will connect to the last end. You can copy these points. Okay. This transistor is connected here with diode. Okay. it is here this transistor emitter will be connected directly to the positive line okay i will connect it to positive line okay in this one yes there is now base we will secure by a tape because this circuit i am make why i am making on a uh, hardboard to easily understand the practical this 10k potentiometer i have 2 kilo ohm 2 kilo ohm resistor actually i need 2 kilo ohm resistor i don't have 2 kilo ohm i use 1 kilo ohm and 1 kilo ohm two resistor in series that is 2 kilo ohm this potentiometer we will adjust it 5 kilo 5 kilo ohm by adjustment screw this is totally 10 kilo ohm this 5.00 okay this 5 kilo and we will check this center and one pin and then center and other pin this 4.9 okay now I connect this diode to the base of PNP transistor yes positive line and PNP positive line and PNP this is base I connected resistor to the base now I connected with positive line yes now we have in this shape now we will connect transistor to N657 you can use any PN NPN transistor any PNP transistor okay this collector I connected with the base of this transistor okay now we can see negative line we generated a negative line yes like this relay coil end and collector uh, emitter of uh, NPN transistor we join together yes like this it is connected here I connected Zener diode 9 volt Zener diode to the base of the transistor and now we will connect a voltage divider network for a sense voltage 2 kilo ohm resistor 1 kilo plus 1 kilo in series with this and center pin of the potentiometer we will connect to diode like this and the other end of the diode to negative line here I connected LED and in series with LED 360 ohm resistor this we will connect to the same end where we connected diode at the same end where we connected diode you can see I connected this interlock diode I connected the same point yes 
and this I connected negative line for battery battery negative terminal and battery positive terminal I will use a capacitor this capacitor it is 220,000 microfarad it is very very big value instead of battery I will use this I adjust 18.5 volt for normal output of any charger okay I connect this voltage to the circuit now we will see I connected multimeter to the output terminal at the battery end this capacitor this is working as a battery we can see the meter screen it is reading 5.2 5.7 when it will fully charge we will see this relay will work and the LED will turn on and the charging will stop and the charging will stop we can see it is sensing with this potentiometer and with the resistor voltage divider network when voltage divider will work now we can see the multi multimeter screen 13.5 13.14.2 at 14.3 volt this circuit switched now we can see the charging stopped I discharge the battery by making it short it is not a good way but I have to do now we will check again and half turn of the potentiometer screw adjustment screw rotated to counterclockwise rotated to counterclockwise okay now we will see what will the voltage level 13.4 13.5 13.7 before it was 14.3 now 14.2 it means there is a voltage level drop now we will adjust a another time counter clockwise counter sorry clockwise clock half turn no clockwise -clock like this like clockwise in the direction of a watch clockwise half turn and half turn any full turn we will make complete full turn of potentiometer to clockwise now we will see 13.3 13.5 13.6 now we adjusted 13.6 that means if we want to reduce the voltage level of cut cutout point cutoff point we will adjust clockwise right side right side direction like this now we will see I will turn on again power supply charger at 13.1 now it shifted at 13.1 I will rotate it counterclockwise now one fourth turn one over four turn counterclockwise now we will see 12.8 12.9 13.2 13.3 13.5 13.6 13.8 half turn slowly rotate less than one fourth and now adjust now we will check 13.292827 now it is charging ok 12.8 13 now it is 13.2 now it is very fine 1 over 8 turn counterclockwise and now I think we will take a good value because any 12 volt battery it should disconnect it at 13.4 13.5 volt now we got a perfect point it is 13.5 volt so friends if you think this video is good for you and uh, you want to watch other videos we can see the uh, relay points will move yes this is moving uh, the relay is moving if you want to watch my next videos and you are first time at my channel subscribe press the subscribe button and turn on bell notification on to watch my future videos and if this video is good 
you can write a comment how you find this video if you want any improvement anything in this video you can guide me in the comments we can see this is 13.4 volt now this circuit we will see with a close view 12.13.2 13.4 13.4 at 13.4 volt this circuit will disconnect the battery and the battery life will extend it thank you for watching my video take care bye bye